foreign officers were among over 230 naval officers who passed out at the Indian Naval Academy. We on correspondent Siddharth MP spoke to the commandant of the Indian Naval Academy, Vice Admiral M.A. Hampi Hawley, who shared the vision of the academy and their functioning amid the pandemic. Vice Admiral M.A. Hampi Hawley, Commandant INA. Sir, kindly tell us about uh, the vision of Asia's largest naval academy. Uh, thank you, Siddharth. The vision of Indian Naval Academy is to transform aspiring young men and women into technologically proficient, articulate, self-disciplined, physically fit junior naval leaders who are resilient in the face of every challenge, self-assured in every company, and imbued deeply with the Navy's core values of duty, honor, and courage. So COVID was a very tough and unprecedented time. So how did the academy function during such times? You see, all of us, in fact, not only the Indian Naval Academy, the world over, when faced with the crisis of COVID, they have, in a manner, reinvented themselves. And Indian Naval Academy was no different. We took upon ourselves to triumph over this adversity. All the training objectives were met in many manners. Say, for example, when we had the trainees come over, we quarantined them, but ensured that the academic classes and physical training within a quarantine facility was continued. We adopted to new teaching and learning methods like blended learning, flip learning, online classes, etc. We embedded instructors within the trainees so that they could conduct drill and physical training uh, regimen uh, in the ongoing pandemic. We also had to cut short the midterm break for the cadets to make good the training time. We also uh, had to, on uh, one odd occasion, even terminate the term leave so that we catch up on training. But we ensured that the training objectives were met. So it's been 12 years that the INA has been functioning. So what is the scope for expansion and growing for the future? Siddharth, so far as uh, the future is concerned, I have uh, outlined my vision for the Indian Naval Academy, which is actually twofold. Firstly, that it needs to be a gold standard in so far as military training academies in the country are concerned. And secondly, progressively at that, to be a gold standard in so far as the academic and technical institutions in the country are concerned. The cornerstone to achieve this is the pursuit of excellence by both trainers and trainees alike with no leniency for mediocrity. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.